Hi, so here we have a problem which was sent by Mr. Ankit Chaudhary from India. So this problem actually reminds me of a paper toy which I used to make in my childhood. I used to take a square paper like this and then I used to draw diagonals of this square. Then I used to cut along the diagonal till the one fourth of the diagonal from each vertex of the square. And then what I used to do is I used to take this corner this corner and this corner and this corner and fold them in such a way that this corner will come till here till the center of this square and this corner will also come here and this corner will also come here and this corner will also come over here and then I'll put a pin at this point the point where the diagonals of the squares are intersecting and in that fashion you will get a fan which will spin around this point anti-clockwise when the wind is blowing and now let's try and solve the problem and the problem statement is following figure is made up of four congruent triangles find area of each triangle so here we have a fan kind of thing which is made up of one two three and four right angle triangles and all of them are congruent so the hypotenuse of each triangle is three centimeter and this gap is one centimeter that means if I call it as base which I assume as x then the height of the triangle is actually x plus one right and we have to find the area of each triangle so if I use Pythagoras theorem x square plus x plus 1 whole square will be equal to square of 3 or x square plus if I expand this using the formula of a plus b whole square this will be x square plus 2x plus 1 this will be equal to 9 or from here you can say 2x square plus 2x is equal to 8 or you can say x square plus x minus 4 is equal to 0. So from here you can find the value of x using the formula to find the roots of any quadratic equation. If you do that you will get x is equal to minus 1 plus minus square root of 1 plus 16 divided by 2. So this will be equal to minus 1 plus minus square root of 17 divided by 2. So then you can substitute the value in the formula to find the area of the triangle and find the area of the triangle. So this seems like slightly lengthy method. The formula of the area of triangle is equal to half multiplied by base multiplied by height. So the area of this triangle will be equal to if I use this formula it will be equal to x multiplied by x plus 1 divided by 2 or which can be written as x square plus x divided by 2 and from here you can say x square plus x is equal to 4 and you can substitute that value 4 in place of x square plus x and when you divide it by 2 you will get the area of the triangle as 2 centimeter square right so sometimes you need not to find the value of x you can find solution somewhere like this also so that's all for this video and if you also have any problem which you want to share with us you can share your problem to the number shown on the screen and for many many more interesting videos keep watching math smart subscribe to it and don't forget to press the notification bell because then only you'll get to know about my new upcoming videos so bye bye till then